one of the things I think it's really important to talk about with a diagnosis like dementia is how to manage the other chronic conditions that, that you have. Mm -hmm. So maybe you can tell me a little bit about how you're managing uh, other medications you're taking right now. Um, the, the medications, I, I don't take a lot, but there are some that I do take. And um, the ones that I'm comfortable dealing with I put in a dispenser, mm -hmm. and okay. so I know which day I'm supposed to take what, mm -hmm. and because I have a I have a yellow one for morning and a blue one for evening. Mm -hmm. So then I I take care of that. But my husband takes care. Um, I had atrial flutter last year, oh. and so my husband takes care of those medications and okay. he gives them to me every morning and every evening. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, those are really important ones to make sure you take the right mm -hmm. dose and at mm -hmm. the right time every day. And um, it sounds like you've done a good job of partnering with him with some yes. of those medications. Mm -hmm. and, and some of them you're doing on your own and some of them he's... The ones I do, I've taken for years. Okay. So mm -hmm. I just, and I've always put them in a dispenser because mm -hmm. otherwise I don't know if I've taken them or not. <laughs> yeah, so that's one way to stay organized. Another mm -hmm. coping strategy mm -hmm. it sounds like you've used. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's really great. Mm -hmm. Do you have a list of all of the medications you're taking that you use to bring with you to doctor's appointments? Yes, I do. Okay. And I have a copy of that as well, and we okay. work on it together. And so we can do med check, um, check mm -hmm. to make sure her dispensers are all mm -hmm. right uh, on the weekends because mm -hmm. it's, it's Saturdays. Is it Saturdays? Yeah. Yep, that we, that they get filled. Yeah. And so we have a list. Of, so we know. Yeah. What you guys are right. one step ahead of me. You're on the ball. <laughs>